what advice can you can you give to people that are a little bit uh, lost nowadays and uh, trying to find a way out out of this? Well, the first thing you can do is all is take inventory of yourself. You we we are going to always go through some situation like this. It will it be as um, troublesome and as as uh, problematic as a global pandemic? Probably not. But I went through the 98 crash. I went through the 2000 bubble of the dot-com, 9-11, when uh, planes were crashing into buildings in New York City, and I was watching them crash, and 08 crash, and now we're in this situation. And whether it's five or 10 years from now, where it's going to be a war or something else, something is going to be disruptive. So we cannot control that. What can we control? Our inventory. What do we have? Do we have physical inventory? Do we have a Rolodex or contacts of a bunch of people that we can work with? Do we have a certain type of education? Do we have technology around us? Do we have this amount of time, this amount of money? And people have to take inventory. And I'm not trying to say it's all warm and fluffy like it's going to be easy. But if you have a Rolodex of people that you can try to find how you can collaborate with, or you can offer help to, or they can help you. Two months ago, those people could have been busy and they may have said, listen, I'm on a plane or a train or automobile. We don't have time for that in our company. You know where they are right now. They're sitting home on their couch and they're trying to figure it out too. You know, I'm, I'm hoping that people are going to, you know, value what we have more, this planet, we have more and things of that nature, but you know, it's gonna be entrepreneurs who, and people like, like everybody watching here today who are gonna come up with solutions where it's gonna make people easy to be uh, uh, conservationists. You know, people are lazy and people do only what's in their best interest generally. And if we can find uh, solutions to help save the planet, simultaneously delivering something to people, that's going to be helpful. Today's consumer, at the end of the year, they want to say, "I didn't give away, I didn't give, I didn't give money away at the end of the year. I gave to 400 charities because every time I bought this, I helped clean up the ocean. Every time I buy this, I help stop human trafficking. Every time I did this, I helped stop global warming." And I think that that is not only a trend, but that is the right thing in business to do, and it's giving people an awareness of what they're doing because they don't want brands anymore to just take money. They want to say, what have you done for somebody? Because I can buy from anybody I want. And I think that is a, a massive change that is helping a lot of people and helping this planet.